Sorry about that, guys. Of course, we got interrupted. But back to what I was saying, going into the actual spread here, the first card that we do have as the energy coming into this week, I do have the Two of Pentacles, okay? So with the Two of Pentacles, um, coming into this week, again, Libras, I really feel as if you guys are having to make some decisions and some choices and really having to decide which which for some of you guys like partner or person that you may be interested in um may be like the best fit for you for others of you this could be like decisions you have to make as far as your finances <clears throat> or decisions you have to make as far as um like your career maybe picking up an extra job or something of that sort um also with the two of pentacles for a lot of you guys this is Im uh, imbalances and with the imbalances here for a lot of you guys you could be trying to find a way to correct that issue you may be having especially if it is financially um now with the being clarified with the wheel of fortune and the page of cups for some of you guys somebody who was juggling possibly two different people or somebody who you did have issues with with having a balanced relationship with maybe coming back around and trying to offer their feelings to you. But this person may be a little emotionally immature because they're showing up as the page of cups. So I would be aware of that. But um, I'm definitely seeing that somebody is coming forward. And this is somebody who makes you really happy. This could be somebody who you see yourself being in a family with. For others of you, this could be somebody who you do have a family with already like a child. Or for some of you guys, this could be somebody who uh, you could be in the process of like marrying or something of that sort but I'm definitely seeing that somebody's coming in and this is making you pretty happy or making you feel complete emotionally now what I do see for last week's energy I do have the page of wands with this there may have been communication coming in from a Aries Sagittarius or a Leo with this uh fire energy um but with this page of wands as well there may have been some sort of new idea or Something that you may have wanted to do as far as like creatively, but with the nine of pentacles in reverse, let me pick it up. Let me actually pick the card up. <laughs> so with the nine of pentacles in reverse that fell on the floor, um, there may have been a lack of funding, especially if this is something that you wanted to do for others of you, if we're talking about in a relationship sense, this is like communication back and forth between you and a partner and with the nine of pentacles in reverse this is you not wanting a wanting to be away from this person or not wanting to be single from this person yeah and i'm definitely seeing that there may have been travel or like i said communication flying at you and you guys were definitely trying to work things out now what i am seeing as far as the guidance for this week i do have the seven of wands with this i am seeing a level of a need for the defensiveness or like the obstacles or challenges that are being either displayed from you like you. OK, how do I explain this with the seven of wands? This is like you not being so defensive or you also realizing as well where your partner may be defensive and why they're being defensive and also like what you're fighting for, because if this is a relationship that you're fighting for where there may have been deception and this person's words don't align with their actions, that may be a problem, especially if you are wanting this relationship to work out. If you're constantly, you know, having a fight with other people who may be involved in this connection or just having to constantly deal with obstacles or challenges that come up, there's a need for you to see things for what it is instead of looking at the full truth and just seeing what you want to see, you know? So this is really going to be on you. If you do reconcile with this person and you do fight for this connection, for a lot of you guys, I do see this energy where you care about this person deeply, but it's going to be a matter of whether or not you can put up with a third party or just the issues that may be present in the relationship, okay? Now, what I am seeing for the obstacle or issue that may come up this week, I do have the two of cups. With this, this may be issues within your relationship or issues within some sort of connection you may have with someone 
um, as far as you guys seeing eye to eye, honestly. And I feel like also there may be a level of secrets with this moon card here. Yeah. And with this being clarified by the five of swords, definitely a level of secrets here. And also for some of you guys, a level of mind games, but I feel like these mind games are like somebody trying to win at all costs. This may be you guys. So definitely make sure you're not being this way as far as this connection, like manipulating information that you know to again, win at all costs because you don't want bad karma to come back at you. Okay. But I'm um, moving past that. What I am seeing for the last card, I do have the tower card. And with this, this is you guys having to address finally what instabilities are kind of in your foundation here with the tower. This is like also a shocking realization as well when it comes to, for some of you guys, possibly another person being attached or again, just shocking information comes out that shows you that your foundation may not have been as strong as you thought it was. And with this, I feel like this is going to help you make the proper decisions to step into more positive energy for yourself and like better times. But you have to deal with the foundation that you've kind of built up and the faults that may may be there. OK. Um, but yeah. That's what I'm seeing for you guys this week. I hope that I was able to give you guys some sort of guidance as far as what to expect. If this did resonate, please make sure you like this video, comment below, and subscribe. And if you do want a personal remember, all that information will be in my comment section and in the description box. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye, Libras.